few moments ago, I was just um, out here and it was storming. And I'm on a little tavern, little area um, for the hospital that I'm at for rehab. And I usually come out here in the morning to um, get some sunlight, get my mind right, get ready for the day and what's going on. But the day I was, came out here and I saw that it was gloomy and all that, but I said, no, I'm gonna go out there anyway. And what ended up happening was I was stuck out here when the storm came. And in front of me are the glass windows, which you saw when I turned it around. And people were saying, hey, 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 um, we're going to come out there and get you. And no one came out here to get me. So it's been actually close to about um, a couple of years, more than four years of me being outside being able to be outside in the rain due to my medical situation. So, and the reason why it's shaking because my hand. But like everything else that we may be going through, when you really think that you can't stand it and you're stuck on an island by yourself. In, in, in about... 20 to 30 minutes, me sitting from the outside right behind me, and I started to get wet. So I moved in closer to the middle, and I was safe. And I don't gotta tell you what that feels like. Many times that you go through things, we all go through things about. And we say that, God, uh, please help me. Because I need your help right now. Because if I don't get your help, I have problems. So, you get that help, whether you think it's God or not. And, and to me, in my situation, Everything after that was great. Like, everything. So, no matter what you think you're going through, dealing with, no matter what, it's like, you can get through it. You just need to keep going and understand that you can do anything if you put your mind to it and you have faith and you have God in your life. Plain and simple. Plain and simple. Um, I definitely don't do these ever. And yeah, there's a reason why this happened to me this morning. And I have an evaluation in about 45 minutes. So they can tell me how much longer they feel I need to be here past the three and a half weeks. It's crazy. But it's all right. Because I asked God, to God, in praying about two and a half weeks ago, I said, man, I'm tired. Things are coming, and I'm tired. I need a break. Actually, I was speaking to Urban. Said, yeah, yeah, I need a break. I need a break. But I wasn't specific in when I was praying. Um, so I got a break. It just happens to be in the hospital getting a break. But like I've said before, these are spa stays, spa stays. Uh, and we get through this. And actually, they asked me yesterday what was my. I see a therapist looking at.